Today we're here at Abergelly or near Abergelly where our campsite was and we're going to cycle along a traffic free route from here to Colwyn Bay and <coughs> maybe Rosson Sea. Providing it's not hilly. Providing it's not too hilly. This is the cycle ride near Abergelly and we're going to follow it right over there to Colwyn Bay and to Rosson Sea. We come right along the side of the A55 and these big cement things are right along the seashore to stop erosion. Alright, tell us what's happening. We've made a wee stop just at this wee hut thing right. just to explore and have a look at the cliffs along here. It was that place along there. Over there, the first place I think is Colwyn Bay, and right at the corner is Rosson Sea, and I think that's the little Orm, just right at the very end. The Orm of Littleness? Yeah, so Orm Bach. What does that mean? <laughs> oh, Little Orm. Yes, time to go. <laughs> that's some kind of yachting place and cafe. The weather's really nice, it's warm, there's hardly any wind. Blue skies and sun at last. That's where we're heading. Well, it's been really nice cycle ride so far. A wee bit undulating at the beginning. When you've got a dislocated knee, that's a bit difficult. <laughs> and Robo copped up. Anyway, that's where we're heading. And isn't it great to see sunshine? Yes, it's been so long. Warm and hardly any wind. So what do you think of the cycle ride so far? It's great, it's great, Mo. it really is good. Yeah, it's, it's really. I'll tell you, the, the cycle paths down here are pretty good. All, all the way, yeah. Tarmacked all the way across no, the coast. No glass or anything like that. And we've arrived in Colwyn, as you can see. That's <laughs> some sign. Fantastic promenade, sparkling clean place. So we've just found an amazing little cafe called the Coast Cafe, right opposite the beach, and it is really, really nice. That's well, a beautiful day, and the cycle ride has been fantastic. So we're going to leave Colwyn Bay and try and head to Ross on Sea. We've come as far as Pendrin. But we're going to turn back and go back and head towards Rill. While the weather's so good, we want to make the best of the coastal road. So on our way back, we've come across this little chapel, Capel Sant Trillo, Sint Trillo's Chapel. Let's go in and just investigate. Oh, it's so cute and so small. The little garden is tended really well. It's beautiful. Can you get inside? Of course you can, yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, it's really cute. There's four little wooden chairs and on this side too. And somebody's lit some candles. Oh, and there's a little vaulted ceiling. It's really lovely. Time to head again? Yeah. The weather is just absolutely fantastic. And this cycle path has got to be one of the safest, cleanest and most picturesque that we've done. This is back now, 14.12 miles on just an amazing cycle track and this is our view over the water. It's really warm today. May go out for a cycle again towards Rill this afternoon if the weather holds. But first, some food. Cycling part two. Okay. 
but we've come up and parked on the campsite so that we're here for tonight and this time we're going to head towards Rill. Frill. <laughs> we've just come as far as Pensarn. Didn't stop, there wasn't really a lot there. And it's just miles and miles and miles of sand and stones. This is the cycle path. Long, straight and flat. Just perfect. This is really nice. Bit of a surprise. This is brilliant. It's a cycle path straight into Rill and it looks really new. Nearly five o'clock and we're here in the heart of Rill or at least down at the beach. We have been cycling for miles and completely traffic free on brilliant tarmac. I'd come back and do this again. Well, a whole day cycling, 32 miles are just over, which isn't too bad. And Guy's going to give our bikes a little bit of a wash. It's still a lovely evening, nice and warm, no wind. Let's hope it lasts for tomorrow. You be cleaning the bike. I'm going to video you cleaning the bike. <laughs> this is the view from our van overlooking the sea out towards the wind turbines it's really quite hypnotic <laughs> 